Hello and welcome back. So in this video, we're going to understand the, uh, the looping concept like NG4. Okay, so we already discussed the looping concept of uh, uh, for shopping cart. So same data I'll take and uh, which I will convert to a cards format. Okay, so for example, uh, so what is the example which we already discussed is, uh, yeah, see in, in our, I think, not here okay core module um, we have uh, yeah this one shopping cart so shopping cart example what we discuss is we display the data in a table format so here I tell you uh, how to display the data in uh, a cards format okay so let me open that yeah so you had a data and this data I will take it again so let's create a component now. So right click open terminal. I already opened that in terminal yeah, here. NGGC shopping cart. Okay, enter. So it's it's been created. Now back here, I'll comment out this and I'll add uh, shopping cart so that you get shopping cart. Okay, so for this, I'll add some UI let's take a section class margin top 3 one container on row column p dot h3 uh, let's say shopping cart uh, you wish you can say text danger and then p lorem 3 tab just for uh, visibility yeah below this i want to display the four cards so generally how you do is uh, let's just take another section okay with the class uh, margin top three and in that i'll just take one container one row single column oh, not the column tag column uh, I just say call MD uh, 3 okay so 4 cards so 4 into 3 is 12 each row uh, in that one card and one card uh, body okay so what my plan is I'll just take a data for data you had taken an interface right so what was the interface we have taken is product copy keep this product interface we have a data serial number name image price and all okay and then i have a data so as of now we have a local data later we understand how to get this data from server so i'll just have my own data okay now i have the products data has resides here and this data this array of products i have to loop through and display so uh, generally if you want to write uh, the names so what you do you will have to write like uh, expression products of zero dot name so you get just one product name but I have to loop through so looping syntax like this so I have to loop which one I have to loop the column multiple times so you write here star ng for let product of products it's like a for off loop looping through each product and the name for each element uh, which was looping here is every iteration is product and you can use that so for example i use product dot name so what happened so four cards has come because it's uh, four items are there so call md3 has repeated four times and that's why you got a four this thing so first of all I need here in the card header I just take an image uh, this to be dynamic binding for SRC let's take property binding product dot image so you get the images okay and uh, can we have like this one card uh, header you take in that you paste and it's all our uh, uh, different sizes I'll tell you how to fix it let's say the class uh, form uh, not form image fluid 
it fits in the uh, card properly okay that's fine and uh, uh, what about here I can take a ul li uh, let's take a class list uh, group and here list group item I'll take the name of the product name so what's the name product dot name see you get the name over here and uh, select that I'll copy and uh, name price let's say the price <coughs> for price you want to display in a currency format so you go with the uh, what pipe currency and the two with INR okay Indian currency you get okay right and below that if you want to display the quantity so all are uh, just two quantity just say QTY the quantity okay that's good so this is how you can loop through the content and finally I just want to have uh, some shadow okay looks good so now uh, earlier we have displayed the content in a uh, table format and now we have displayed the data in a cards format so this is how you will loop using ng4 see you written the what only one column and it's been looped n number of if you have 100 products are there and all 100 products will be looped uh, and display in a cards format okay so this is all about a for loop ng4 directive of angular so that's it thank you so much and let's meet in the next video for another concept thank you